How did Michael Jackson die? Michael Jackson died from overdosing on a combination of sedatives and prescribed medication. Jackson's in-home doctor, Conrad Murray, was found guilty of involuntary manslaughter. How old was Michael Jackson when he died? Michael Jackson was 50 years old when he died, which may seem young, but when you watch the video of him practicing for his tour which was supposed to start later in 2009, it's easy to see that the singer was not well. Although he had always been skinny, he seemed to be even skinnier than normal, sweating and breathing with difficulty at even the simplest dance moves. Therefore it should come as no surprise that the singer died of cardiac arrest. Pair this with the fact that he was prescribed drugs that were at too high of a dosage for him. And you have the perfect combination for premature death. The drugs found in the artist's body when he died were propofol, anxiolytic lorazepam, midazolam, diazepam, lidocaine, and ephedrine. If this sounds like a lot of drugs, it's because it is. The doctor who prescribed all these drugs to Michael Jackson was later found guilty of manslaughter and served two of the four years he was sentenced to. But many feel that justice was not served. Unfortunately, there is no way to bring Michael Jackson back from the grave. If the singer had not died in 2009, he would be 65 years old in the year 2023.